Hello everybody, Nero X back again. Welcome to a special late breaking music in Minecraft video. In the footage, I'm kind of failing to create an arboretum. But anyway, Gorillaz recent re recently released four new songs, Saturn's Bars, Andromeda, and I'm blanking on the other two, honestly, I haven't heard them yet. But from the two I've heard, their new album, Humans, is going to be great. Saturn's Bars is like a more reggae, ravish, reggae, fusion kind of feel to it. You know, to be honest, I get why some people wouldn't like that song. But yeah, I dug what I heard. It's got auto-tuned. It's not T-Pain levels of auto-tuned, but it's auto-tuned used correctly, a la the Zap and Roger or Daft Punk method. And Andromeda reminds me of the album Plastic Beach, which, by the way, you should totally go listen to it. And Andromeda has a more ravey, electronic, almost video like 80s video game kind of feel to it to me. But yeah, those four songs, and I need this new Gorillaz album in my life. But anyway, I guess I should kind of give my own little spiel on why I love Gorillaz so much. And one of the obvious reasons is they're a band you can't judge by one song. And some bands you can generally get a feel for how they make music, how they write music, how they arrange who they work with off of one song they made, like early Beatles stuff. And I love the Beatles. Kind of sounds like, really sounds like you know, that time period. You know, late six. You know, the early six, mid to late sixties, early seven, nineteen seventy. You know, really poppy, radio, friendly. And then, as the Beatles grew as artists and matured as people, they began to get more experimental, more thoughtful, more, um, just a little bit of more of everything a band needs to be successful. And another thing I love about Gorillaz is, is their collaborations. Like, Damon Albarn is a great songwriter and can seemingly make anything a hit. But when he works with guys like Del the Funky Homo Sapien, MF Doom, Dan the Automator, Bobby Womack even, he can, like, it just gets that, the pot gets that much sweeter, as the old saying goes. And what's another thing I love about Gorillaz? Oh, right, the song Clint Eastwood, which is easily my favorite Gorillaz song, Fight Me, I Know It's Overplayed, and Feel Good Inc. And the last thing I love about Gorillaz is just how unafraid they are to be weird. Like, not many bands in the world would be entirely virtual and consist of animated characters. But Gorillaz is totally unafraid to be as weird as they are, and... It's so refreshing to see that, especially now. And you see a more... Now as we're in a more risk-adverse type of economy, music structure, music industry, entertainment industry entirely, really. That's why you're seeing so many remakes, because studio executives, with a few exceptions, obviously, are afraid to take risks with new properties that aren't proven to be successful and when they do make a new prop take have a new property or a new idea they usually over market it to the point where it just feels bland and didn't have the originality it may have had when it started and i do understand you know you if you make a movie or make a song you want it to be you, want, you know you want it to do well but there's a balance between mark over focus testing and over marketing something that executives seem to for, have forgotten about or if you're going to focus test something focus test a variety of people that way you can get the vast appeal you want while also still having the creative energy behind something which is you know what entertainment thrives on creativity but anyway that's my spiel about the state of the entertainment industry and music in general and yeah go listen to those new gorilla songs they're amazing go check them out anyways i'm nero x i hope you enjoyed this video like share and subscribe if you want more from me and i'm out of here peace
Hello everybody, Nero X back again. Welcome to a special late breaking music in Minecraft video. In the footage, I'm kind of failing to create an arboretum. But anyway, Gorillaz recently recently released four new songs: Saturn's Bars, Andromeda. And I'm blanking on the other two, honestly. I haven't heard them yet. But from the two I've heard, their new album, Humans, is going to be great. Saturn's Barge is like a more reggae, ravish, reggae, fusion kind of feel to it. You know, to be honest, I get why some people wouldn't like that song. But yeah, I dug what I heard. It's got auto-tuned. It's not T-Pain levels of auto-tuned, but it's auto-tuned used correctly, a la the Zab and Roger or Daft Punk method. And Andromeda reminds me of the album Plastic Beach, which, by the way, you should totally go listen to it. 